Hundreds of people in eastern Congo awoke Sunday to streets covered in lava. Homes and buildings destroyed. The volcano's fiery eruption caused widespread panic in the city of two million people. Thousands of Goma residents ran for their lives, fleeing with whatever they could hold on to, including mattresses. Everyone is running away. The massive fireball turned the sky bright for kilometers. Many desperate residents had only small buckets of water to try and save their belongings. Lava is now close to reaching the city's airport. Many streets are impassable. Power has been cut off to most of the city. The Congolese president is returning home from Europe to help coordinate relief efforts. Officials have launched an evacuation plan. I asked the population to remain calm and follow the instructions of the police, this official said. But there was little calm as this dangerous volcano rained down its destruction. Uh, being cautious, as you can see, uh, people with their bugs, kids. Many residents were upset officials did not warn them ahead of time. The volcano was about to blow. There's no information, this man said. People are panicking. The last time this volcano erupted was in 2002. That explosion left 250 people dead and 120,000 homeless. Rwanda's Ministry of Emergency Management says at least 3,500 Congolese have crossed the border and will be lodged in schools and places of worship. Jennifer Johnson, Global News.